again. We are going to see how to check your controllers for firmware updates. Occasionally when uh, you get console updates, you'll get firmware updates. And we need to see if your controllers need new firmware updates. And that's pretty simple to do. So, hit your home button on your controller. Go over to settings, down to... You're going to come down to connect and devices. Go down to devices and accessories. You'll have a representation of your controller there. Go down to more options. And you'll see this one's assigned to me. It doesn't log in as anybody. And right here is your firmware. You'll see notice it has no updates available. If there was an update, it would have update there and you could actually perform your controller update on your Xbox One uh, controllers. Since the Xbox One has not got Bluetooth capabilities, you'll actually have to connect your controller to your console with a USB. You would click on right here where it says no update and we could actually re-update our controller right now if we wanted to continue. Um, I'm not going to on this one. Uh, the new S controllers and the X controllers uh, have Bluetooth capabilities and you can actually do that wirelessly. Uh, that's how you will update your controllers. So take a check and see if your controllers need updating. Your S's and your X's I believe are now updating automatically as, as console updates come out. But you still need to check them. Your Xbox One, you need to periodically check them make sure and we are going to kick on another controller here and you'll see it popped up there it is representation of the elite controller same thing more options that one has no updates available it either and that's how you can check all your controllers yeah. back to the original one so take a look make sure everything's up to date uh, if you have any issues with them that should help correct them if you need to get firmware updates on good luck and happy gaming